Now, I just wanna remind you guys quickly about car seats. Now, we all know that you should have your kid in a car seat, the correct car seat, it should be installed correctly, but what you might not be thinking about is you still need to check the car seat periodically. Not just that it's installed correctly, but you wanna check the actual car seat to make sure it looks like everything's in working order. And the reason I tell you this is that we are headed out of town again, and so I went to check his car seat, and I think it's broken. Um, I'm not sure, but now this car seat we've had for four years, it has treated us well, but on the back here, do you see this? There is this bar <laughs> that is sliding out, which connects this piece to the base. It's not able, it's not going all the way back in. So I'm not really happy with this. I, I'm just, I'd rather be safe than sorry. So. It is, we've used it for four years, it's done great, but we're gonna go ahead and swap it out because I, don't, I just don't think that th this bar coming out is a good thing. And like I said, it doesn't go all the way in. Um, so there, obviously it is broken. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna switch it out. And since my son is turning seven next week and I wanna keep him in a five point harness as long as possible, we're gonna upgrade him to an even bigger seat, but it has a five point harness. We're going to the Britex. Frontier click tight, which is a weight capacity with the harness of 90 pounds or 58 inches. He'll probably hit the 58 inches um, faster, but as of right now, he's only 48 inches. He's only 50 pounds, so we have a long way to go with the Frontier. Um, and so this one is gonna go, and the new one is going in. Okay, less than two minutes later, and the Frontier click tight is installed. I don't know why I'm always so surprised how easy it is to do the click tight, but look at this install. That is rock solid. It is not moving a centimeter. Plus, I installed it with the vehicle seatbelt because my child is over the weight capacity for the latch. But even with the vehicle seatbelt, it's so easy. Just make sure you remember that if it's forward facing, that you do do the back um, tether. That uh, that's very very important. So. We've swapped him out with the newer seat. Um, he's gonna be in this for a while because it goes up to 90 pounds. I'm pretty happy with this. And this also doesn't get in the way of his brother and his sister next to him. Um, so I think this was a good idea. So remember to check your car seats, not just for the install, not just to make sure that their belts are exactly where they need to be, but also that the car seat is working properly and there's nothing kind of wonky with it. There's nothing broken, like which was mine, um, which I think was broken. So I'm glad we got the new one.